Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, with the new update for Fortnite, the monster or dragon or whatever it was that was in the ice of Polar Peak has now broken out and there is no longer the Ice King's castle. So, you might be wondering, where did it break out to? Did it leave trails? Um, well, yes, it did leave a trail behind. It leave like a footprints pretty much. Um, the sadly, as you all may know, Greasy is not back yet. Um, so also what's kind of sad is the fact that they did not do this as a live event where it broke out. I am assuming that's to I guess reveal something for season 10 when it comes as a live event by letting it get out during an update. So I'm not entirely sure what's going to happen. <laughs> so there you guys go. That's Polar Peak. It's all broken. You can see it slid down and everything. You can't quite see where the monster would have came out of but it must have been pretty massive for this whole side wall to get destroyed okay so the footprints there's one right here as a matter of fact and it is a pretty massive footprint so as you can see this footprints um probably about pretty big actually so if you can imagine the footprint being this big on its own and this is just one of its feet um his foot would probably be about up to there in height if you're going straight up from here pretty much to where the second layer of my wall would go and basically his whole leg like depending on if it's a dragon or not if it's a dragon the things it's gonna be absolutely massive guys no matter what it is it could be godzilla or it could be a dragon we have now ruled out the fact that it is a kraken we don't have to i guess worry about that anymore um the other footprint which it has to be massive to be taking steps this big the other footprint is right here and it's same size okay the next footprints just right up here right there next footprint boom now as you guys may have known this house right here something stepped on this before and it was some sort of i guess dinosaur but what's weird is let's respawn real quick if you look at the size comparison it's quite odd really it's almost as if this footprint this footprint here must have grown or something like that or I'm not entirely sure. Maybe some mother or something grown and it flew off that way where the Ice King's little glacier come from came from. And I guess it like mated in a way. Uh and basically the egg got trapped in there or something and the dragon or whatever it is grew while it was in the ice. And the ice must have been hollow or something like that. So the footprints lead all the way here from Polar Peak. So this this beast is on the move. As you can see, this tree would have been knocked over, so it must have taken some pretty massive steps to not be able to knock it over. So that is actually it for the footprints. Um, they just kind of disappear. I'm assuming because this is like a road type deal, they the footprints wouldn't show up. Um, let's see something. So they just stop right there. Which I don't quite understand, really. If it's taken steps that big, it could have taken a step here and then placed its left foot somewhere in this area, but what I am thinking is if it is Godzilla... 
if the rumors are true, then that means his left footprint could have been here. And he just basically dove into the ocean. And what I like about that idea is if it is a Godzilla event, it is quite possible that at the volcano, as you all may know in the new Godzilla event, the, dra the three-headed dragon comes from a volcano. It could be coming out from underneath the volcano, and Godzilla could come here. This could mean mass destruction for the map, though, which I really don't quite understand. Or it could mean something like a boss battle. I like the ideas of both of these, to be honest. Whoops, wasted two there. <laughs> okay. So let's go explore some more. Let's see if we can find any other signs of this gigantic beast. Okay, there isn't really much in Polar Peak, to be honest. I mean, in Snobby. Okay, that was a fail, guys. Ignore that. I am very excited for this next event for Season 10. It could mean some huge map changes. Hopefully, they don't end up getting rid of, like, all these other areas. I'm thinking if it is Godzilla event, Dragon's going to fly over here. All of Polar Peak, all this area that was never here before is going to go away. Um... Now, if he did go into the ocean, I'm presuming that he would have gone out that way. I'd have to do some more exploring. There are no other signs of any footprints around right now that could change. But yeah. That's an update on the current event that Fortnite's going through. Let me know in the comments what do you guys think is going to happen and how it will happen. And also, let me know if you guys are going to like this event or dislike it and yeah, stuff like that. I hope you guys all enjoyed the video and the new theory, I guess. See y'all next time. Peace out.